My name is Tony Starks. I own Comics in a Flash. Uh, besides having sold collectible comic books, bought and sold collectible comic books since like 1978. Uh, in the last 10 years or so, I've, my business has provided the service of cleaning and pressing books uh, to get them looking their very best prior to sending them off to the grading companies like CGC or CBCS. The idea is you improve the appearance, you improve the grade, you improve the grade, you improve the value of the book. All right, so Tony, here's what we got. This came in yesterday. A buddy of mine got this for the price of a Happy Meal. Nice. I nice. thought it would be good for him to get this graded versus just trying to sell it outright. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. A book this key should definitely be graded. Looks like it's got a little bit of a stacking curl here. What probably happened is it was stored in a stack and. There was a big stack of books on top of it. Looks like you got a little bit of a scratch there. That's the sketchy part. Yeah, sadly we see a little tiny piece out of the edge here. You check to see if it has the value stamp. Yeah, that's the one piece that... Uh, yeah, there's the value stamp. You hope that Shanna's in there. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of kids clip these out and put them in the sticker book that Marvel would give you. You know, the idea behind cleaning and pressing books is that there's good defects and there are bad defects. Good defects are things like bends, ripples, waves in the book, uh, dirt on the front and back cover. Those are things that can be fixed with cleaning and pressing. Bad defects essentially can be summed up by saying anything that breaks color, uh, like, you know, makes a line in the book, or anything that stains the paper, because stains go all the way through the paper and they can't be cleaned out without using solvents or chemicals or some sort of wash. And CGC, CBCS, the grading companies consider that restoration. But surface dirt, pencil marks, those sort of things can be cleaned off and make the book look a whole lot nicer. Sometimes cleaning a book makes a bigger difference in how it looks than even the pressing part of it. So as that sits right now, what do you think that would grade at? And, you know, with a little bit of a piece out, it probably would be like in the 4, 4, 5 range. But I think that with a press, we'd probably get it 6, maybe a little better. But definitely we want to clean it up, get rid of a little bit of dirt on the back cover here. The book's a little crooked. When we get rid of the stacking curl, we'll also line it up a little bit more square. Uh, it'd be a solid mid-grade 6, maybe a 6.5. A whole lot more than happy now. Yeah. Have you looked it up? What is the book? I mean, six five. What is the book? Couple of thousand. Couple of thousand. Uh, around the four or five range, like you said, you're probably dipping down to sixteen hundred, maybe. I mean, I charge fifteen dollars to clean and press a book, and this book probably increases four or five hundred dollars in value. I'll pay I you fifteen dollars for four hundred dollars. <laughs> All right, work your magic. Bring it back when you're done. Let's All check right. it out. All right, so I'm going to take the Hulk 181 here that your friend got for the price of a Happy Meal. We're going to take it. We're going to get rid of that spine roll. We're going to clean it up, uh, work the other things that I can do on the book. Uh, then I'll bring it back into the store, and we'll take a look and see uh, before and after pictures. And then we'll send it off to the grading company, and we'll see what CGC has to say about it. <laughs> 